Many Rochester seniors today got a surprise visit for Mayor Ardell Brady at their doorstep. Mm -hmm. He's delivering their lunch as part of a program called Meals on Wheels. Yeah, he does this and it surprises people when he shows up at their door. This week is a special one, though, that involves not only the mayor, but other government officials as well. Hannah Tran explains. 1920. Rochester's Mayor Ardell Brady made an unusual trip around town. Use metal stairway to enter building. He visited the homes of seniors to bring them a hot meal. Hi. Hello. It's the annual Mayors for Meals Day where mayors across the country personally deliver meals to seniors. We got a big list here. I guess it's nine people at eight different locations. This is part of the Meals on Wheels program where volunteers bring meals to seniors who are unable to prepare or get their own. I mean, it's so essential for a number of people that do get a, a, a meal, a hot meal. Mayor Brady signed a proclamation to kick off the event. The intent is to bring awareness to senior hunger. Hunger is, is not simply an urban issue, it's a rural issue, and it tends to be uh, rural seniors. Representative Tim Walls visited the area to talk about vulnerable groups when it comes to feeding families. Now, among them, he named children as well as seniors, but especially seniors in rural areas because it can be a challenge to figure out ways to consistently deliver food to those rural communities. People tend to think that when winter's coming to an end that the issue of hunger uh, kind of abates. It doesn't. It actually increases. For Mayor Ardell Brady, it's not just about filling hungry stomachs. It's about fulfilling a need to provide access to a standard, healthy life across all ages. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. Sweetheart. In Rochester, Hannah Tran, ABC 6 News. And Mayors for Meals is a nationwide event. It's part of the 12th annual March for Meals campaign, which is a celebration of Meals on Wheels all throughout the country. Speaking of which, we're also in the middle of our food share month, and with far too many people in our community who go hungry every single day, we would like you to continue to help us stuff our studios. We are partnering with Channel One Food Bank, collecting non-perishable food items in Rochester and Austin. It's happening all throughout the month of March, and if you can't make it to our studio,